Never Hit Garage, presented by NHOU Protective Coatings, is brought to you by rockauto.com. All the parts your car will ever need. Custom Splice, recovery gear made for you. Magic Creeper, the most versatile creeper ever. And by NH Oil Undercoating, the official oil-based rust prevention system. Hey, thanks for tuning in to Motorhead Garage presented by NHOU Protective Coatings. Now, this is the I wish I'd have thought of that portion of the program because I'm telling you, this is one of the simplest inventions you've ever seen. It's one of the coolest inventions I've ever seen, and you have the best product name we have ever seen on the show, the Oil Udder. Now, Kevin, tell me what the inspiration was behind this. We got really frustrated changing our own oil, and the mess didn't have to be that way, so we set out to solve the problem. 120 years of changing oil, and someone has finally made it clean and easy to do. Yeah, very simple. It has a very tough nitrile rubber, ready for your garage, ready to be beat up. It has a magnetic attachment that'll fit to the bottom of the oil filter, so it holds itself kind of like your third hand, and it directs the oil where you want it and not where you don't. Well, this is a Dodge Ram pickup truck, notoriously difficult to change the oil and especially hard to do it without a mess, but you can do it. We can do it. All right, we'll get to work here. I'm going to check in with our buddy Elliot over here. Elliot, I see you have two different oil letters there, so you got everybody covered, right? Yeah, Dave, so we have the three inch oil udder and then we have the four inch oil udder XL. You're gonna wanna make sure uh, you take a look at your vehicle's oil filter and look at the outside diameter. These products will work with oil filters that are smaller than that three or four inch rating. They are flexible and you can usually find the outer diameter on your parts site. And then uh, you have a couple accessories you brought with you too. Uh, this is, you call it the stand? We call it the mag stand. So it's a magnetic stand. Um, there's magnets on the back and there, there's also a magnetic oil bottle holder below it. So your oil letter can drip into it and not make a mess. This can stick right on your toolbox with a magnet or there's a nail hole there for it as well. And that's so cool. That makes it easy to save all the oil and you don't waste any. Yeah, absolutely. And we find that with this oil that you'd otherwise spill on your car, wipe up with a rag on the ground, you can actually recycle a little more oil. And a lot of our customers that work at dealerships or, or some customers that work for companies that have fleet vehicles have found that they're able to recycle a lot more oil to be able to better work towards environmental standards and regulations that help them save when it comes tax time. So business owners, if you want to get your ISO certification, you can either build an entire solar farm or you can get the oil udder and you can check off the same box on your taxes. It's worth the same amount. <laughs> now tell me, Elliot, if you've got a filter that's mounted at a strange angle, uh, how does the oil udder deal with that? So on strange angles, here I have the three inch udder. Um, you're going to put it on here and you're going to loosen the filter slowly. And just like if you were to tip a coffee cup slowly, coffee's going to run down the side. It's going to decant down the filter and go right into the oil letter. So just make sure to go slow and you'll catch the flow. Well, one vehicle that's notoriously tricky, this Dodge Ram pickup truck. Now we're going to step over here and see how Kevin is doing. All right, Kevin, I noticed you went for the oil filter first, and that's kind of opposite of what I've always been taught. Yeah, and it works really well with the oil letter because the inside is going to get oily. You want it to be a tacky and clean to start, and then it helps it take the oil filter off. It can be a little tricky with this vehicle and some others. Yes, uh, occasionally the blocks have oil coolers, trucks have oil coolers, other attachments, lines to the, with the engine, and there can be a column of oil that will drop as soon as that oil filter disconnects and having the udder position underneath will catch that oil. So it becomes a funnel there and everything drains nicely. And uh, it's also a removal tool then when it comes time to take the filter completely off. Yes, it is. And with the, the stickiness and the tactfulness of the rubber, it'll help you grip it and take it off really easily. Once it's done draining there, you close the cap. And I, this is the part I love. You've got a really cool stand for the oil letter. Because you always feel like you need a third arm doing an oil change, we have it there ready for you. It keeps the drips from getting all in the frame on your floor, on your garage, and you keep it clean. Now onto the oil drain plug, which is actually a really easy step here. Uh, you loosen it with your wrench, put the oil letter over there and the last couple turns and out comes the oil. And it couldn't be easier, couldn't be cleaner. Absolutely, the plug will drop into the oil udder, be caught by the magnet, and then you can direct the oil where you want it to go so you don't miss your oil pan. And this is, if you're doing it on the ground, this is where you have your splash pad. Exactly. Keep things nice and clean. Well, it's as simple as that. It's so cool. There's no oil on the sway bar, no oil on the frame, and no oil on your hands. It's the oil udder. Makes oil changing really simple and really clean. Check them out at oiludder.com. We will return with more Motorhead Garage presented by NHOU Protective Coatings in just a minute.